Hey everybody, hello, hey, how you doing? Welcome to another episode of Unorthodox. I don't know why I said it like that, don't don't ask me. I've got no control over how I talk. Last episode we made our amazing dino in the background. So yeah, let's go, let's go. What, oh no, what happened? I was gone for a week, I was on vacation. <laughs> I, haven't, I haven't been on for a whole week. So I just, I don't know what's been going on. What? <laughs> oh no, wait, is that like a cat collar? Pretty kitty. Okay, um, it's it's not a cat actually believe it or not. This is what they call a brontosaurus <laughs> Pretty kitty, huh? Pretty kitty. Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. But anyway, we got this big old big old dino done and it's looking absolutely fantastic huh? Oh my gosh, there's a sheep now. I don't know what's been happening again I leave for a week and when you're gone on an SMP like this for a week everything changes okay i i don't know what oh is that another dino oh my gosh i think that's another dino yes the plan's working now that i have a dino everyone feels like they have to have a dino i'm such a trendsetter look at me oh hi amelia jay i'm looking at everything that's been built here because it's all very pretty i haven't been here for a whole week because i've been on vacation and everything's different oh this is nice this is nice is it like a casino flooring it's jam stat poker Oh, stat poker. Get good stats, do good all the stats. things, oh, and then play okay. stat poker. And just <clears throat> do you think everyone. breaking this piece of mud would help me? Um, well, if you do it about a thousand times, maybe. <laughs> uh huh, uh huh. Sheep heads sign up. Sheep? Sheep heads backs? Sheep heads backs? Yeah, okay, apparently there's sheep heads. Wait a second! <laughs> <laughs> they just covered my entire building! Not the entirety! Pretty this much. Side of it, it's barely mm. touching. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I feel like this was intentional. So this is Aurora's shop. Do you want to uh, go inside? Mm -hmm. El Aurora's bedrock service. More details inside. Let's mm -hmm. go inside. Mm -hmm. Inside. Amelia. <laughs> Welcome to the caves below spawn. This Good is luck. just caves. What is the point of this? Apparently there's signs somewhere. Is this whole thing just a ploy to get me to read? <laughs> Do you never read? Well, not never, just yeah, never. Oh my gosh, I've missed this so much. Mwah, mwah. Mwah. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's so cute. It's got freckles. That's that's quite the hat he's got there. <laughs> Wow, look at me. I can't see anything. Look at that goose guy just oh. running away. So majestic. Okay, well that was fun, but I need to stop getting distracted because I've got some very big plans for today, okay? And we need to stop getting distract. Hey. Huh? Hey. What? Hey. Hi, 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 hey. spider. Hi, do you wanna- do you wanna do a build with me? A build? Do with you? Yeah. But yeah. aren't you, aren't you like yeah. part of some mermaid alliance? I don't know how the cocoa beans feel about... I don't care about that. You don't? Do you, you want to go on a, uh, do you want to, do you want to do a field trip with me? A field trip? you want to build, build something? Mm. Wait, all right, you're getting a little a close. Field trip. I, I, I don't trust you. Aren't you going <laughs> to, don't you, you eat brains. You're from season two. No, I, I don't eat brains. You don't I, eat I brains? I don't care about brains. Really? No. no. Oh, I could have sworn, I could have sworn. <laughs> hmm. No. Oh, that's interesting. That, that's, that's interesting. That's weird. <laughs> oh, interesting, yeah. interesting. Well, I don't know. I had some plans already. Yeah, but Magic School Bus? Okay, say no more. I'm in. Magic School Bus. <laughs> let's let's do it. Okay, okay. Um, yeah. Yeah. So the server's going to be doing an ultimate super fast pig race using a data pack we have where we can breed animals to become really super duper fast. And a lot of us are taking sections of the track to design to make it all look really cool. And so Spider and I are going to be taking this section of the track and we're gonna be making it Magic School Bus themed. And I am so excited for this. I love the Magic School Bus. With the frizz? No way. But before we get started on that, I really do have some other plans for this episode as well. So we're gonna go ahead and get started on that because another member of the server named Draken, who's actually making this cathedral up here, which is coming along very nicely. But he has put together this really cool community thing over this way called the North Tower. And basically how this works is different members of the server can take a section of the tower. It has to be 10 blocks tall exactly, and you have to make there be a way up. And I want to make my own section to this tower, okay? Because I just, it, I just think it's really cool. But the thing is, the deadline to make a layer is like, 
this weekend. And if you know me at all, you know I am quite the procrastinator. So yeah, I, I need to get started on this if I'm actually going to do it. So for the build I have in mind, I actually need mushroom blocks. Apparently behind this snack somewhere, there is a dark oak forest. Ba -ba -da journey, journey, a long journey. I am going on a really, really, really long journey. I spy with my little eye something that's dark oak and is a forest. Now then, let's get our little choppy choppy on. Plasma's having some trouble at the trading hall. I think I'm, I'm gonna go help him. What what happened? I don't know, Jay. <laughs> oh, hi! Ah, hi! <laughs> Ouch. How many and other people does it take to to end a raid? The whole server. Thanks, y'all. I honestly just came through the portal and was dead. I don't know what happened. Oh, okay. Who gave my my dino acne? No, they're extra sprinkles. I know what it's meant to be. <laughs> Who put sprinkles on my donut? Me and Loon. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Spider Loon strikes again. Wait, have you stricken before? Struck, struck. No, this was the first prank. This this was uh, the first prank. So it's not really again, is it? <laughs> Spider Loon strikes. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> Okay, so I was going to sign up for this thing that Plasma put together, but then, you know, chaos. Plasma has put up an April Fool's thingy McJigger, where we're like, we're like signing up for it, and then we're giving either a prank or a whatever you can read this. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta just name one of these, and then we got to submit it. I am now in the system, and uh, I will be participating in this. So it'll start on April 1st, and then it'll just go for the rest of April, pretty much. But I swear with this server, I log on to sign up for an April Fool's Day event, and maybe go mine some quartz, because I need some for my North Tower project, and I somehow get roped into fighting a raid. I, I don't know how this stuff happens, but you know what, I absolutely love it. Also, sp sprinkles... Sprinkles, sp sprinkles. It kind of looks like it has chicken pox. I'm not gonna lie. And they called it a donut sore and another pun. Another, another, oh, this is kind of, I mean, if you can really call it a pun. And Loon took part in this. It was also Spider. We actually ended up pranking Spider back. He covered her dinosaur in frosting, but that's already been cleaned up, so. But uh, I, I need to get Loon back because it's not just this. But he also left a pun in my base last episode, if you remember that. And and that's that's not gonna stand. That is not gonna stand. So what's the only way to combat a pun? <sighs> well, sadly, it, it's it's with another pun. So Loon is currently living right down here. Now I don't know if you can even really call this a base, because there's just there's there's honestly. There's nothing here, so I've got my idea. There's almost no sign of life here. It's chest pathetic. Barely even a home. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay. He, he, he started it, all right? He, he started it. Okay, but anyway, I went expediting and I got myself quite a bit of quartz, another quartz. So let's go ahead and see how much of that we've managed to get a hold of. I don't think this is gonna be enough, I'm gonna be honest. But it's at the very least a start. I do know that Rogue has some villagers that trade for quartz, so we can also go see about doing some of that. Yeah, okay, looks like we're gonna need to do some villager trading. Okay, resource gathering took way longer than expected, but I am now officially ready to start working on this Anortha Tower build. So, let's go!
Okay, so here we have it. It's the finished product. I kind of wanted to go with like a little cottage thing. It was kind of based off of like little fairy cottages, I guess. And if we go ahead and build up a little platform up here so we can get a little bit of a better look at it. Yeah, I, I think it's pretty nice. I like it a lot. Now, if we go ahead and we head up through here, here it is from the inside. So I went with a little like kitchen setup just because it's not very big. And the way you get up is you go wah, wah, and then you jump up onto the ceiling fan and you climb this vine and then you get to the uh, the next section of the tower. Yeah, I think it's really nice. So a lot of other members of the server ended up going ahead and they did a race through this tower, which was pretty fun. You can go check that out from their perspectives because I sadly was not able to make it. And then they went ahead and they fought the Ender Dragon Finally, and uh, Teach and Rogue brought me back this pair of elytra, so thank you so much. That was that was so nice of you too. And uh, yeah, honestly, I really do like this build quite a bit. I hope you like it as much as I do. And uh, April Fool's Day is coming up pretty quickly here, and this has actually given me an idea. Last episode, I kind of talked about the Drama Club, which is the group of people on the server who are doing like super heavy lore. Like Director Amelia is doing some time space stuff, and Plasma's got like ice power. And, and there's like a lot more lore people as well. And as I said, I don't really feel any need to do lore personally. However, what if I pretend I am doing lore? But we'll save that for next episode. Oh my gosh, I can fly. I've missed this so much, honestly. Oh yeah, my dino is still covered in sprinkles. I gotta clean that up at some point here. So somehow Teach convinced me and the other members of the Coco Bean Alliance to go and fight an ancient city with him. Yeah, I honestly have no clue how he convinced us this was a good idea. But uh, yeah, so we went and we faced the warden together. And, and and as you can probably guess, it was just very chaotic. Honestly, I think this pretty much sums up the entire adventure. Oh my gosh! No! Oh no no no! no! Behind you! Ah! This is terrifying. I have never been this scared. I don't want to move too much. Yeah, I mean, I ran. I'm nowhere near you, Rogue. I am. I got out of there. <laughs> like it was an immediate. The warden came and I was gone the very next second. Yeah, I don't have any lights and I don't see anything. Ah! There's another warden. Teach. There's a warden. Okay, there you are here. A warden, you, teach. Get away! Get here. away! <laughs> Jay, not helping. <laughs> and then later on, Teach came to me saying we had to talk, which is never ever a good sign. What yeah, happened, but... Teach? What did you do? Let me tell you a story about a time when Teach was streaming and Spider Hearts came. Right, right, okay. Yeah, so Coco Bean Alliance. Uh, uh, have agreed to go on a very dangerous uh, adventure. Huh? What's but, happening? <laughs> uh, but, uh, you know, the rule that says J and Teach mm -hmm. can decide to... to Where are to you stop. going with this? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we, we are going, we, 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 the Coco Bean Alliance are going on an adventure. What kind of adventure? I think it was a warden, maybe a woodland Again. mansion, and Again. On, a, on the same, same stream. On the same stream? <laughs> But we are friends with the, with the mermaids. Oh, that's Yay! good. That's good. That's that's probably a good start. And they're gonna eat our brains when we die. Yay! Wait, what? Why are you celebrating? That. Yay, it's Our, fun. It is? Oh, it's fun. Oh, yay, it's fun. Yeah. Wait, yay, it's fun. Sorry. I, uh, yeah. Sorry, I, 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 I give in to peer pressure pretty quickly. Yeah, yeah, I can, I can see that. Yeah. Oh, you're welcome. This is uh, Casa the Teach. Oh, wow. So, Jay, you know, I we I promised that you were going to have like an apartment or a yeah. place. Yeah. So you choose which one. Oh, yeah. which one of these buildings? Yeah. You I have think. a hot tub here. I have a Oops. I have a hot tub if I pick this one. Yeah. Look here. Here. This is like a little bit like a. Whoa. Okay, I think I, I think I know which one I'd like. Have you noticed also that Rogue doesn't like meetings? Yeah, I I did notice that. What yeah, is this? I... This is like our eighth meeting in a row he's missed. Yeah. Wow. I I don't know if he knew about this meeting though, but he should. He's but he should be meeting. here. He should be here. That's like not knowing about a meeting is no excuse for missing it, in my opinion. No, no, no. no. And he's like, oh, I have a life. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my gosh, what a loser. <laughs> Can you believe yeah. that? Okay, with that all out of the way, it is time to meet up with Spider and get started on the Magic School Bus build. I cannot wait for you to get to see this Magic School Bus. Uh, uh, Magic School Bus. Magic School Bus. Do you want to... Magic the school bus. Yes, I, I want to read Magic the school bus now. Let's let's. Okay, perfect. Do the thing. Do the the thing and the 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 thing and the stuff with the. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Exactly. Perfect. Okay. You you have a way with words. <laughs> Who's your favorite character from Magic School Bus? Miss Frizzle has always been fun. I do like Miss um, Frizzle. Got to admit I'm I'm kind of an Arnold stan. I always kind of liked Wanda. Oh, that's fair. I like Wanda. I always liked Arnold and Liz. Yeah, Liz is great too. Other than Miss Frizzle and the School Bus, if you were trapped on I don't know, like a desert island, which of the cast would you want to have join you? Carlos always makes all the puns. So the, I guess your options would be humor with Carlos. I feel like Wanda could also be, she'd just be kind of fun. Yeah. Then you've got like Dorothy's smart, I guess. At least that was her whole thing. Definitely not Phoebe. No, not Phoebe. Because you know, the one thing that you really don't want when you're on like cool magical adventure to have somebody be like, we never did this. Really cool. <laughs> so we, we learn a lot about what isn't at Phoebe's old school, but what does happen? at Phoebe's old school. Do we ever learn that? I don't know, actually. Exactly. She's always just That's like, this fun. never happened at my old school, but it's like, okay, but then what did you do all day? Maybe they were even crazier and she's actually just mocking them for being so simple. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she yeah. was, she's just like, outer space. Nah, nah, we were going to other dimensions. <laughs> At my old school, we were secret agents. <laughs> yeah, at my old school, we did sting operations. <laughs> this is my new headcanon. So, let's move from Magic School Bus talk to Unorthoblocks. Oh, that's crazy. Uh, what? Unorthoblocks. Unorthoblocks. Why, why would we talk about that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, 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 of course, of course. Okay, Unorthoblock. <laughs> How are you enjoying being on the server so far? Oh, I'm loving it. It's so much fun. It's also very chaotic, but that's part of why it's so much fun. And, like, all the behind the scenes so stuff i love fun. it i love how we we all just hang out and it's not always for content inside jokes will will come out of it you know stuff like there's too much mm -hmm. cheese in my water and, yes. and that time i was a ribeye yeah <laughs> <laughs> and yeah. it's just, it's just, yeah, it's, it's just fun. It's just, it's fun. Okay, so it's not quite finished yet, but here it is. Here's the magic school bus. Ah, it's so nice. We've got a few more little details to add on. We're gonna make some passengers doing their thing and all that stuff. And we gotta fill in this little gap here, obviously. But for the most part, here it is done. So the pigs will come through like a so and head out this way. And this, this is, this is, this, this little guy is so cute. I, I love, I love this guy. And yes, this is a horrific scene of the magic school bus crashing and as you can see over here its wing fell off okay this this is a terrible horrible accident that miss frizzle got them all into and i can tell you one thing if i was arnold i definitely would have wished that i stayed home that day hi jam i got my own pet jam now <laughs> i don't i don't know i just uh-huh uh-huh Um, this this isn't at all worrisome. <laughs> Hi. I be your pet. Oh, a pet jam? Ooh, okay, okay, okay. We can make this work. We can make this work. My very own pet goose. Wow. This honk, is this is the honk. best day ever. Honk, honk. honk. Uh, don't worry. I, I've trained these to not donuts. That's that's good. That's very good because. That would be kind of worrisome. I've had a pretty bad experience with the goose once it tried to eat me, but... Okay, let's see here. What do I do with a pet jam goose? Take it for walk. Okay, take it for a walk. Here, come with me. I'll I'll bring you to all my favorite places for, for geese. Perfect. Over here, we have a pretty a pretty sad scene. You can see these, these two... I mean, this chicken died, so I'm sure you're fine with that. Roadkill. Love it. My favorite thing to be on walks. Is this what people do with their pets normally? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think that's pretty much uh, the main tour of Spawn. Perfect. This is nice. I've always wanted a giant pet goose. Uh, have all your dreams come true. They have. Coco bean goose. Oh my gosh, that's that's amazing. Oh! Oh! No, my goose! My goose! No! No! Goose! Goose! No! No! This is... This is the saddest day! I get a pet goose and then it just dies! 
jam, my goose just died. Oh, your goose died. I got a pet giant goose and it just died. Oh, it's so sad. I know. If I look at it from the wrong angle, it just disappears. Because he, he's a ghost. Oh, it's a it's the ghost of my goose. Ghost goose, bury him now. Yeah. Oh, here lies <laughs> ghost. Goes. We killed him. We killed oh, him. The best part is we can just make another. Oh, really? But that's gonna do it for today, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Unorthoblock Season 3. Next time, we're gonna do some April Fool's Day shenanigans, which is super duper exciting to me. I love April Fool's Day. I know that that's already passed for all of you, but for me, it is tomorrow, and I am so excited for the prankage, okay? It's just, this is gonna be so much fun. I love, I love doing stuff like that. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. I just, I really, really love this series. I think it's the perfect mixture of, like, chaos and, and... Why are these crossbows so huge? What what in the world? I swear, if you give an unorth a person a server-wide resource pack, they're gonna wanna make your crossbows be ginormous. But as I was saying, I think the server, it's just, it's the perfect combination of chaos and like actually doing real Minecraft stuff. I hope you enjoyed this episode. That's gonna be all. Goodbye, 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 goodbye.